So it's homework for April 26th. So we learn a new chord today, which is C sharp. One, 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 four. And let's see, take a look at this here. So one, 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 four. And we always look at chords like this. One, 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 four. And this is very similar to C chord because C is zero, 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 three. You know this one? C sharp is a little higher, right? Sharp means a little higher. That's why I just move everything plus one. So what's zero plus one? One. Yeah, one. And three plus one, four. So it's just C, shift it up. Okay? And another chord you, know, you learn, I think you learned in the last song, which you played really well today, was three, two, one, one. And then we're going to do this. Three, two, one, one. Ring, ditto, index, index. The C sharp will do index, we'll do a bar chord. So you were having problems just with the C sharp chord today, which is, it is hard, so don't worry about having problems. Make your, make your hand here flat like this. Because you were pressing it like this, which is natural to do. But you gotta make it like a piece of, like a plank of wood that's flat. So, so I'll play the ending, which has all the chords. So B flat. And then C sharp, D minor, which you know from before, and C. So I'll just play this one time. practice this a lot. B flat to C sharp. Two hardest chords. Okay. Um, that's it. <laughs> it was in Zoom. It was in Zoom too? <laughs>